hello friends in this session we will discuss about the login button when the login button is pressed it should show as a processing then it should validate or redirect so just I am writing the script in page load event and just creating as a string passing the string as a process script and equal to insert I'm just uh, getting this value this dot value equal to processing processing and then this dot disabled equal to true okay after that I'm just uh, passing the attributes to add on button clicking so just I am creating the button one which is the button ID dot attributes dot add and adding that when it is clicking on click the button getting the string value which is the process script which I have given this processing so just after getting the string value just giving as a client script client script dot getting the post back event reference which is a button one and the text should be empty when it is clicked and uh, it should show the processing so just give enclosing it from to string and then closing this function after that I'm just saving it and going to browser and refreshing this one after refreshing when I'm clicking this login button it will appear as processing then it will validate so just look out here when I'm clicking login it's not showing what I have committed string disabled processing So just I have not ended this as a single code so just I am giving the semicolon after that I am refreshing this after refreshing look out here when I'm clicking logging it will show as a processing then it will load has and check that username password is incorrect and invalid it will it has showing the error message hope you enjoyed that's it for today in next tutorial we will discuss about how to disabling the label automatically in few seconds if you like this tutorial don't forget to subscribe hope you enjoyed it